Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Linda for those that are new. Um, thank you so much for all the new subscribers. Um, if this is the first time of watching my videos, go back and check out all my other videos. Um, and don't forget to subscribe. I'd love all the support. And yeah, leave me a nice comment down below and let me know that you've subscribed. Um, yeah, so I went to Big W spe specifically to look for shoes for my daughter. Um, but yes, of course, I didn't find any shoes in her size. And I went to the girls section to check for sh uh, the next size. or the, I think it starts in a size 6 in the next section. And they weren't appropriate at all for her age. So I thought, no, I'm not going to grab anything. But... I still ended up doing a little bit of a shop because it's very rare that I'll go to this specific shopping center in the next town. Um, that's a motorbike. I don't know if you can hear that in the background. Um, believe it or not, I'm on 10 acres and I can still hear the neighbors on their motorbike. Um, yeah, so I thought I'll have a look around. My kids were being good and, you know, I really just wanted to see what they had. And they've got some really, really cute clothes for the kids and very very inexpensive so yeah I thought why not let's just grab a few things um, but to start off with I picked up a new water bottle I'm going to I've got three more weeks of no exercise after surgery so um, I'm just preparing myself my in-laws have got like a little mini home gym set up in their garage outside I want to do the Sonia Kruger workout but um, I thought maybe just some weights as well um, and on the treadmill while my in-laws look after the kids who knows <laughs> um, but yeah so I picked up a new water bottle this was I think $12 it's a cool gear brand so it's very sturdy it's got a straw um, it's very big like it's very wide so absolutely love that I'll give that a quick wash and start using it um, now for my daughter I picked up a pair of these jeans uh, they're called the short chino jeans they were ten dollars um, yeah re th that's a good price and I yeah should be wearing this quite a bit seems like it might fit her to her knees by the looks of it um, so it's a longer jean. I also picked up these bloomers to wear underneath dresses. Oh my goodness. Like how cute are these? That's the front and this is the back with the ruffles. These were $4.50. I know Kmart have got the plain ones without the, the frills at the back. So I'm going to have to stock up on some of those. Um, but yeah, uh, I thought this would be really, really cute underneath her... Um, underneath dresses to eliminate the the showing of um her nappy she is going to start toilet training but not uh, not until like closer to the end of summer next year uh you know february marchish um so yeah uh i picked up these shorts they're a thin linen uh short these were eight dollars thought they were really cute and they they're they're adorable. That that showing it on camera doesn't do it much just, justice, but they're really really cute. I picked up these shorts. Now these are an extremely like they're the the see through sort of linen shorts. These were in the sales section, so they were originally seven dollars, but I picked them up for four dollars, and they've got that waistband, that adorable waistband. Like it looks so cute with a white t-shirt or a pink t-shirt. So cute. Um, and I also picked up this t-shirt. I'm using this new ring light and I'm absolutely loving it. Loving it. Um, and sorry, this t-shirt was also in the sales section. There's no original price on it, but I only picked it up for $2.00. So, yeah, check out your sales section at Big W. They've got some really cute stuff. Now, this is going to sound absolutely disgusting. But I was in my ensuite uh, uh, the night before I went to Big W. And I thought to myself, I went through my eyeshadow palettes. And I thought, you know what? I haven't bought eyeshadow palettes 
in three years and they do expire and I was always wondering why they were like hard and I wasn't gonna I wasn't getting any um, pigments in up I collected a whole bag like a like one of these bags but the cold bag of um, eyeshadow palettes that I had I was mortified and some of these eyeshadow palettes I have not even touched like can you believe it like it it's they were open but I haven't touched it so I thought three years I haven't invested any money into eyeshadow palettes um, so yeah I knew when I was going to Big W that I wanted to check out their uh, makeup section because they were having a sale I don't know if it's still on um, this is a week later uh, but I picked up this Rimmel London eyeshadow palette uh, there we go um, really really nice I love it I love all the colors on this palette and this was $11. I don't know if I mentioned that already, but that was $11. I thought, oh, it's a steal. I'm going to grab it. These are the colors that I would majority use on every single other palette I've had. So you would see like, you know, you get a palette with four and there would always be one of those four that would be completely used. And these are the colors. So I thought, perfect. I've got what I need. And then I seen this Astralis one that was also eleven dollars. Um, I mean, I won't specific. I won't necessarily use these um, teal colors. I'm not that crazy, or this one here. But I, I like more of the um, the browns and the pinks and the purples. Um, so I, this is more. These are more of a matte. These are more of a shimmer sort of um, eyeshadow palette. This is a matte palette. Um, or they've got some some shimmery ones. I think there's only four, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, five of them are um, shimmers and the rest are matte um, eyeshadows. So I thought, awesome. 11 bucks. These can both fit in my makeup bag. I didn't want to have the situation I just got rid of I could easily say there was 70 eyeshadow palettes yes 70 um, I didn't want that situation again so I'm just sticking with these two I'm gonna use them this has got 30 months this one here has got 12 months after opening so I'm just gonna stick with these and be done with it. I'm done $22 and I'm done for the next two years um, at least. So perfect. Now that's basically it for my big W haul. It was a very short one. Uh, I didn't check out the ladies section. I know sometimes they've got some cute clothes in the ladies section. I might have to go check the ladies section out but I'd leave it at that hopefully everyone has enjoyed this haul and is keeping safe fingers crossed we come out of isolation soon um check out I've got a whole heap of hauls coming out um in the next coming weeks uh I've just gone nuts subscribe like this video and I will see, oh, leave me a comment. Definitely leave me a comment. Let me know if you're a new viewer, if you have just subscribed, how you're doing. I'm always open for a, a, a good conversation. Um, yeah, so have a lovely day, everyone. The sun's actually started to come out. It's been gloomy all morning. Um, and my daughter is not sleeping. So... It's going to be a long afternoon for me. Wish me luck. I might need to have a cup of coffee. I'm, I'm that tired. I don't know what's wrong. I'm, I'm definitely going to have to get my iron checked. But subscribe, like, and comment down below. And I will see everyone in my next haul or daily vlog. Bye.